up you guys after show reacts here and today i'm gonna be watching some more angel uh so this is season three episode two and it's called that vision thing so i'm just gonna uh clarify something here with everyone um so the copy so i have a digital copy of the five seasons of angel um because i can't be bothered using the dvds because scratched um even though i purchased them like thanks jb hi-fi thanks um anyways and so the first three episodes were a little dodgy so um if you watch the first episode's reaction um you would see that there was like two little glitches like at the very end and when angel appeared um, and then for episode two and three, for some reason, they were switched around. So I watched episode three, but it was titled episode two before I watched the real episode two, which is what I'm going to be watching now. So I didn't know this. So I like uploaded the episode and everyone was like, this is episode three. So, luckily, there wasn't, like, any huge spoiler or anything in the episode, so we're good. We're all good. Um, I took that one down on Patreon, um, and this one will go up first. Um, and the same goes for YouTube. This one will go up before the one that I have already watched, which was... Yeah. Hopefully this makes sense to you guys. Um... We just sort of went through like all of these different things that could have been wrong. Um, apparently there was like a production thing where um, apparently that old gang of mine was actually supposed to be the second episode, but ended up being the third episode. So that could be why, that's probably why it was all muddled up. But um, we've sort of like, we've we sort of figured out that there shouldn't be any more problems. I don't know if there is. If there's probably one more problem, I'm probably going to get another um, version of the season. But, yeah. Uh, sorry about all of this stuff. It's very annoying, I know. Let's get into it. Also, I just want to say, actually, just before, uh, I was like, I watched the second episode, and it was called That Vision Thing, and it was about gangs, and I was like, what has this got to do with about visions? Like, it makes no sense, and I was like, trying to like, figure it out, and I'm like, maybe it's like a, like, you know, the gang's vision of who's good or bad. <laughs> I was trying to like, find a way for it to make sense. I didn't need to do that. <laughs> Previously on Angel. You know Lila Morgan. How was that? I felt quite genuine. B plus, C minus. A girl can tell. Fred, if you feel comfortable enough grading our sincerity, how about joining us for the rest of the meal? Wasn't that the point of coming downstairs? She's so cute. I guess that'd be okay. It's like sitting under a table. <laughs> um, I, I don't mean to rush you back into the 21st century, but how about using some chopsticks? Or uh, a fork, maybe. You remember forks, don't you? <laughs> sure. Who could forget? Fork, pitchfork, fork it over, fork in a road. One I'm not ready to take yet. Excuse me. Uh, hi. I'm sorry I, I didn't hear you sneak up on us. Must be those tastefully expensive Gucci loafers. Totally. He's from Wolfram and Hart. He's Gavin Park, attorney with Wolfram and Hart. Pleased to meet you. Is there a problem? No, no problem. Mr. Park was just leaving. No. I like Actually, Liz's I scruffy arrived. hair. It's so cute. This is a list of 57 city code violations for your hotel, including earthquake proofing, asbestos, and termites. Be advised, I filed a copy of this with the city planning office. G, 57. 
Is that a lot? <laughs> Why is he trying to shut them down? That's so stupid. They'll just find a new place. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Minion of darkness, Satan's toady. But that is a nice suit. Did you see that suit? Fred! Good to see you out and about. It is, isn't it? <laughs> out and about. I've been twerking with gun. Oh, you saw, did it have four or five claws? Five. Feel certain? Pretty certain. Oh, baby. Look at how much the pink is faded. It's ridiculous. Anything of interest yet, Fred? Sure, lots. H is a fascinating letter. Helicopters, helium, helmets, hernias. Did you happen to notice herbs in your wandering? I did. Yeah, circling. I think we might be looking at either a Wan Shang doll or a Cantonese Fook beast. I say we figure out Fook what these beast. things are after we find that crap. Sounds like a plan. Hey, Fred, I need you to do something for me. <laughs> God, six got scratched here. <sighs> Your time are welcome here. Since when can a brother buy some ginseng tea? A Jew? Him? Vampire not welcome. This is a public facility, and any being may enter. We're looking for an ancient coin. Oh, sure. you think some fancy flipping and a little hollering can intimidate guys like us? Okay, what about your kind? You two take grandma, I'll take the old man. Yeah. Infestation. The senior partners felt I would be more useful here. I'm looking okay. at a little something aimed at angel investigations. If you're interested, I'd love to have you on my team. So is he like the new Lindsay? I'll be right in. Let me tell you a little something about your team. You don't have one. Look, just because they gave you Lindsay's old office doesn't mean I have this office because I earned it. As did Lindsay. He sacrificed his flesh and blood for this company. Literally had his hand cut off fighting against Angel. What are you doing? Building code violations. I'm fighting Angel in my own way. Yeah. But he's really terrified. Has anybody ever told you you're exactly like Lassie? Yeah, you're like Angel's Lassie. Sure, he does most of the saving, but it's your visions that tell him that Timmy's trapped in the well or the robbers are hiding in the barn. He really needs Timmy, to depends on like you. from Passions. Well, thanks. <laughs> I'd be flattered except for the Lassie being a dog part. Dennis, a little help here? See, I'm not alone. I have a ghost. Bye. We'll have to... What the hell? Is she turning into a demon? Oh, God. Cordy, we should talk about this. You can't ignore what's happening. I don't want to talk. What's there oh. to say? Oh. Cordy. The definition of vanity is look at her. Except gross, yuck, and unclean. I want the key and I want it now. Uh, well, wh which key might that be? I mean, okay, sure. Man, did, did you lose the original? Yeah. Looks like this. Uh, yes, of course. Um, this should only take a moment. 
I know you're probably disappointed that you couldn't go fight that thing with the angel. Right. Because why would I want to walk with a cute young woman on a beautiful night when I could be out hacking and slaying an ugly boil-covered demon monster and getting myself killed? I can't apologize enough. Hey, I just follow orders, no matter how tough the job. If I lose the visions, I wouldn't be able to help you anymore. Yes, you, you would. You need me. That's not why I need you. You're important. The visions are just aftermarket extras, like her shifter or Krager wheels. Did you just compare me to a car? <laughs> it was a very nice car. I guess it's better than a dog. Cordy, let us try and help. How many times did I tell you if we don't have your 1099 on file, then payroll can't cut you a check? I know, I know. What hey, the hell's Cal Penn doing here? Let's just finish the job, then we'll talk about taxes. The boss. Wasn't he already in Don't Fear Bad? Talk. He was and like, a, a, done. Um, I can't think of the I word. I don't know what you talked about. All that fire? <laughs> How could I forget? What are you doing, Lila? Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh no. Cordy? Are Cordy. they doing this? Is Mr. Brain Dude doing this? Anything. It's because you're strong. Stronger than you realize. I'm not. He's strong. If you Are weren't, you, you would have tried to give up your visions like so many times. But I don't want the visions anymore. I tried to be brave. figure it out? I think so. Something you probably won't like to hear is that both artifacts are considered objects of good. No. So the Chinese guy and the Boyle guy also aligned with the forces of good. Damn. It's so hard to uh -oh. tell these days. Now they Old should wear the pel pins or something. Well, in the meantime, the inscriptions on the coin and the key match, they actually work together to transport you in and out of the other dimension. Well, I don't suppose we know what this other dimension is like. I mean, besides what you're saying, Dime. Based on the burn scars Cordy received from the last vision, I'd imagine fire's not out of the question. Fire. And if the young man is imprisoned, I'd imagine there may be guards. Guards. I don't need to explain to you that if Wolfram and Hart are behind this mission, it can't be good. Well, that's kind of nifty. You sure I can't come with you? Take care, Cordy. That's not good. It's alright, he's angel, he doesn't need weapons. Angel, I don't know how to tell you this, but the, the dawn is on Buffy's show, not on yours. Is someone burning in there? Um.
You know you're not supposed to be here, right? Yeah. What about him? Oh, him? Oh, he's supposed to be here. And this guy. You have any idea how monstrous a guy's got to be before he gets sent to us? We're a very high-end institution. And it's your job to keep him here. Yeah. I'm Skip. Angel. What a weird name for a demon. So, uh, you live in here, Skip? No, I, I commute. You're a vampire, right? How come it smells like you work for the powers that be? Because I do. But you're here to try to rescue this guy? But we're on the same side. Now, shouldn't you be helping me keep him in here? I know, I know. Long story. Involves a girl. I don't like it any better than you do. So I really can't talk you out of this. Sorry. I wish I could. I guess we'll just have to agree to Disagree. <laughs> Skip, are you okay? Good. Sorry about this. Just say they won't do it again, though. Okay, but like, what the hell? What makes you so special? It's just business. Right, just business. That is to say that he won't do it again. Don't you come at me through Cordelia ever again. You play that card a second time, I'll kill you. It's protective of Cordy. I've been told you are very powerful, very wise. I've tried everything and I can't get rid of it, so I ask you, what is you this thing rid of it? growing inside of me? And how is it possible? The father is also a... Vampire? Yes. Though, not a very good one. I will need some blood. This has never failed me. It sounds like something someone would say just as something's about to fail you. I'm just saying. Um. I cannot help you. No man can. This is not meant to be known. Yeah, yeah. Look, I haven't heard that before. Well, I guess there's only one thing left to do. Time to go visit Daddy. I'm very, very intrigued about this whole dollar situation. Um, how dare they do that to Cordelia? I love how protective Angel is of her. Low key shipping. Um, which is so weird because I know for a fact that I said in like, I think it was season two, that they were never going to happen. Or something like that. Turns into a Buffy. Oh my god. How could they do this to me? This poor, poor Cordy. It's 
stupid wolf of a time. What the hell is special about the dude, the, 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 um, the fire dude? Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. I guess I'll see you in the next episode. Uh, 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 uh.